so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Hello! Hey, hey! It's me, Blippi, and look at where I'm at. Whoa, today I'm at Young Chef's Academy in Covington, Washington. This place is so cool. Yeah, it's where young chefs, kids just like you, can come here and learn to cook some delicious treats. Ah Let's go! Hi, Flippy. Hey, who are you? My name's Chef Riley. Oh, nice to meet you, Chef Riley. Hey, do you mind if we go explore the kitchen? Go for it. I'll see you in a sec. Okay, let's go. Wow, look at this kitchen. It is so bright and colorful. The very first thing that I need to do when you enter kitchen is wash your hands. Okay, I'm gonna turn on hot water and then I'm gonna rinse them. Okay, get them nice and moist. And then we need some soap. Okay, and we need to scrub for 20 seconds. And one way to do this is to sing the ABCs. Ready? A, B, C, D, E, F, G. H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y and Z. <laughs> okay, now we get to rinse off our hands. Let's get them nice and dry. Now, once our hands are dry, clean, now we can put on an apron. <laughs> yeah, an apron is used so then clothes not get dirty when you're cooking with some food. <laughs> All right, and can't forget my Young Chef's Academy chef's hat. <laughs> How do I look? <laughs> All right, check it out. This kitchen is so colorful. Do you see all these cabinets? Yeah! Whoa! These, yeah, are the color green. Ooh, this over here, yeah, that cabinet is purple, pink, yellow, and blue. Whoa! I bet there's a lot of cool things in these cabinets. Whoa! Look at this! Some yummy vegetables! Hey! You know what kind of vegetable this is? Yeah! This is an orange pepper! <laughs> Look at these! Yeah, some green beans! I sure do love vegetables! Alright! <laughs> I'm so excited! Whoa! I am so excited! This is gonna be tasty! I am looking at the recipe of what we're going to be making today. Looks like we're going to be making crispy green beans. Whoa, those look tasty. And creamy ranch dip. Oh, this is going to be so yummy and healthy. I love vegetables and I love ranch dip. I wonder if we're going to be able to dip the green beans into the ranch dip. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So it seems like we need a lot of tools and a lot of ingredients. So, uh, let's get to it. All right, let's see what's in here that we need. Okay, looks like we need some measuring cups. Ooh, a small one. A medium-sized one. Another medium-sized one. And a big one. Put those right back here. Perfect. Then we need whoa, a juicer. This is where you can put a lemon or an orange or a lime, squeeze it on top, and then all the juice comes out the bottom. Okay, we'll set that down right there. Alrighty, let's see what's in here. Hmm. Oh, we definitely need some measuring spoons. Whoa! Yeah, same thing, just like the measuring cups. The measuring spoons have four different sizes. From small, to medium, to medium, to large. <laughs> okay, put them 
right, about right in there. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, uh, let's see, how about, uh, oh, wow, a measuring cup. This is what you put liquids and you could do solids, but this is primarily for liquids. And this is what you measure to see how much you have. Okay, put that down right there. Oh, let's see, is there anything in here? Hmm, there's a lot of cool things in here. Whoa, look at this, it's a rolling pin. <laughs> oh, so cute. This is a small rolling pin. Whoa, and this is a big rolling pin. Whoa, they're used to flatten things out. I don't think we need those today, but they're pretty cool because you can use them for drums. Okay, enough playing. <laughs> let's get to cooking. All right, let's see. Um, probably right in here. Oh, yeah! Two ingredients that we need. Breadcrumbs. And flour. Perfect. Okay, we'll shut this. All right, there we go. And uh, let's see, how about some cold ingredients? Wow, look at this fridge. It's so organized. Huh? Okay, looks like we have some cream, probably for the ranch dip. We'll set that down right there. Ooh, some cheese, Parmesan cheese. <laughs> Okay, we'll put that down right there. And then we have some eggs. Yeah, check this out. Whoa, whoa. Okay, we'll put those down right there for later. <laughs> Probably shouldn't do that at home. And then we have some mayonnaise. Put that down right here. And some sour cream, okay. Put that down, and now, I think we're ready. Hmm. Uh, looks like we have most of the ingredients and tools, but this looks really hard. Oh no, if only I had some help. Huh. Want some help with these? Oh, sure, I hey. Hi, brought... hey, I brought the rest of our ingredients that we need. Oh, perfect. Okay, well, here's the recipe. What do we do first? First, we're gonna to wanna to preheat the oven to 425. Okay, uh, I know how to do that. Okay, preheat the oven to 425. Perfect. <laughs> Good job, Whoopi. Thank you. All right, first we're gonna to wanna to do a tablespoon of flour into our bowl. Okay. We're gonna to wanna to make sure that we get a true tablespoon because that is not accurate. So we wanna scrape off the extra flour. Okay. Okay, can you do that? Sure. Okay, looks like we need some flour. Let's do a little scoop. And there we go. And perfect. Great job, Lippy. All you. right, next we're gonna wanna crack an egg. Okay. Let's see, so at Young Chefs Academy, we crack an egg using the table, not the edge of the counter, so that it doesn't get all over the floor in the mess. Okay. <laughs> You want to crack hard oh, and use your thumbs to break open the egg. Just like that. Perfect. You'll want to put the shell in a separate bowl. Okay, here we go. Let's use the table. There we go. Great job, Luffy. Thank Next, you. Next, we're going to want to wash our hands because we touched a raw egg. Oh. Rinse them off. It's really important to rinse off your hands and wash them completely after touching raw eggs or meat or anything like that. Now we're ready. Okay. All right. Next, we're gonna want to do a cup of panko. Okay. Use our cup there. Wow. So that looks about right. 
Yeah, so is panko just like breadcrumbs? It is, it's dried breadcrumbs. Okay, all right. Oh, I'll just use that. Okay, one big scoop. All right, in the same bowl? Yeah, oh, so sorry, in a different bowl. Oh, okay. Oh, thank you. Okay, here we go. Whee! Perfect. All right, next we're gonna wanna add the rest of our spices. Which okay. is garlic salt and salt. Okay. So we're gonna wanna use a, tea, a fourth of a teaspoon of garlic salt in our panko. Okay. There we go. This one? Mm-hmm. Okay. And then put it in the panko. Perfect. And then half of a teaspoon of salt. Okay. Thank you. Salt is so yummy. Here we go. Can you use your whisk and whisk that up? Yeah. Oh, check it out. This is a whisk. Yeah. And How you do you do it? Whisk with your wrist. Okay. Whoa. This is a really good way to mix good it all up. Job. Yeah, you want to use it like that. All right. Next, we're gonna to wanna to put our egg into this mixing bowl. The clean mixing bowl that we have. Okay, here we go. Put the egg in this bowl. Whee! Oh. <laughs> All right. And we're gonna to wanna to use a little bit of water. Some water like this. In with the egg. Perfect. Thank you. All right, put some water in with the egg. Perfect. Can you whisk, the, whisk that egg up with the fork for me? With the fork. Okay. Forks are easier to whisk eggs than a whisk is. Oh. So you wanna whisk it just like that. Okay, so let's take the fork and let's whisk the egg. Whoa, did you see how the yolk broke up? Yeah, now it's all mixed up. Perfect. That's perfect. We're gonna grab a couple of handfuls of green beans right in here. Okay. All right. Perfect. And toss it in our flour. All right. Make sure you get them all nice and mixed up and coated in flour. Okay. Toss it. Wow. This Look is gonna help the egg stick to the green bean. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> Look, they used to be green, but now they're green and white. <laughs> hey, remember how we washed our hands? Yeah, good thing we did because I'm touching food with my hands. You don't want to touch anything after you touch egg or raw meat. You want to make sure you wash your hands. Okay. All right, now we are going to touch the egg. We're going to put the green beans. We're going to use two different hands. We're going to have our dry hand and our wet hand. So we're not gonna touch the egg with this hand. We're gonna put our green beans in here and toss it around. Okay, take the fork out. Now, do a little tossing. There we go. Whoa, <laughs> I'm spilling. That's okay. Okay, wow, look at it. <laughs> There's so much egg on these green beans. All right, great. Now you're going to want to put the green beans into the panko. Toss them around real quick. Okay. Wow. Good <laughs> that looks job. fun. And once they're nice and evenly coated in panko, you want to put them onto the tray. Okay. Whoa. These are going to be so yummy. I know. I'm excited. Let's put them a little bit nicer so okay. that they're not so messy. Okay. All that right. way they'll cook really evenly when they're spread out on the there tray. There go. That makes sense. Oh, I see. Because if they're on top of each other, then the heat can't touch the whole green bean, huh? Exactly. You want to make sure that the whole thing is getting cooked. We're ready for the oven. Okay. Here we go. 
Here you go. Thank you. Perfect. Those will take about 10 to 12 minutes to cook. Whoa, that was really fun making those green beans with you. Wasn't it? Yeah, let's make some ranch to dip them in. What ingredients do we need? We need mayonnaise, sour cream, buttermilk. Ooh. Wait, did you say buttermilk? Yeah. Oh, I said cream earlier. Okay, so we need buttermilk. Yeah, they're very similar, but buttermilk smells different and it's a little thicker. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, lemon juice, dill weed, parsley, chives, onion powder, garlic powder, salt, and black pepper. Okay, perfect. Looks like we have everything. I think we do. All right, next we're gonna wanna so I have mine all mixed up. Can you put the mayo and the sour cream into your big bowl? Okay, here's the mayo. And then we have the sour cream. All right, there we go. Awesome, now we're gonna wanna do half a cup of buttermilk into okay. your bowl. All righty. Go. Perfect. All right, now we're gonna wanna get our fourth, one fourth teaspoon. Okay. Perfect, I'm ready. And we're gonna use that for our dill right here. Okay. Parsley and our chives. Okay. Dill, parsley, and chives. There we go. Good job, okay. <laughs> Next we're gonna want our half teaspoon. Okay. Bigger. <laughs> All right. All right, and we use that for our garlic powder okay. and our onion powder. All right. Okay, let's give it a little scoop. Okay, and then this one. Perfect. This is gonna be so yummy. All right. Perfect. Let's mix that up with our whisk. Don't forget, we whisk with our wrists. All right. Whoa, this smells so good. Once it's all mixed up, we're gonna cover it and place it in the fridge to cool. All right, we only have three more ingredients. Okay, what are they? Lemon juice, salt, and pepper. Okay. First, we want to juice our lemon. So okay. you have a lemon right up there. Perfect. We have it cut in half and we'll use our juicer here. We want to make sure we squeeze really tight, pushing down and twisting it around to get all of that juice out. Okay. Yes, I'll try. Oh, there we go. Good job. Oh, yeah. When you take it off, your lemon should look something like this. Yeah. It's almost empty. Perfect. <laughs> okay. There's that for you. And then we'll want to pour our lemon juice into our ranch. Okay, here we go. Whee! <laughs> awesome. Mix that up. All right. Yum. Now we want to do one fourth teaspoon of salt. Right like this. Okay, put some salt in here. There we go. Whee! <laughs> and a pinch of pepper. So we'll go about three twists. Okay. One, two, three. Perfect. Perfect. All right, let's mix that up. All right, mix, mix, mix. And remember to mix with your wrist. Oh, yep. Oh, wow, this is going to be so yummy. <laughs> Delicious. Did you hear that? I did. Does that mean the green beans are done? It does. You want to grab them? Sure. Oh, this is going to be awesome. <laughs> oh, yum. Wow. Oh, they look delicious, Blippi. Whoa, check them out. Oh, my gosh. It looks like our green beans and zesty ranch are all ready. Oh, so good. Those look yummy. Check them out. 
Whoa, I am so excited. Thank you so much for teaching us how to make these. Of course, you did such a good job. Come back anytime. Oh, well, thank you. <laughs> See you later. See ya. Wow, I am so excited. <laughs> Here we go. Mmm. Mmm. Yum. That is delicious. <laughs> so silly. Yeah, you'd think because they're green, they're not good. <laughs> but hey, trust me, it's really fun to try new types of foods. Yeah, like these yummy green beans that we made. Yeah. Mmm. 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 Yum. Even healthy foods can be really yummy. <laughs> good job cooking. Wasn't that fun making those green beans and that ranch dipping sauce? Yeah, it was so tasty. Hey, if you want to check out the exact recipe, you can go to Young Chef's Academy website and check out their blog. Woohoo! Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B L I P P I. Flippy! Good job. All right. See you again. Bye bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make the